Welcome back, people. Um, this is uh, an update on the building. Um, this one is about the glass balustrade. Um, we've decided to go with the glass balustrade even. Uh, we decided a long time ago from the beginning when we're building the house that that's what we're going to use. Now, when I was about to do it, I just have to look for referral because um, sometimes referrals work. And also I look at other people that does it but um this referral that i got they did someone's work and the cost was reasonable so i thought oh i can get this one and it to be reasonable too now but the first thing i want to put across is this guys when you get a referral you only get a referral for an artisan one thing i need you to understand is every building is different everybody's taste is also different Everybody's spec anybody you know all our specification my specification is different from yours your specification is different from mine uh for example my building the it has it actually has six balcony or porches the front has the long one and then also the 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 down has three porches which is almost the same size as both the front and back and the sides go the side going to the pool. On the top also I have the same thing. I have another porch that overlooking the pool, which is gonna be where I put the pergola. And then the and at the back there's almost also a, a porch down and top. And then the front is where I said the long one. Also, inside the building, I do have the void, which is three sides, almost the same equal size, the three. And then the stairs, which is also going to be, both sides going to have glasses. And the stairs, for the glass, it has to be bent. You have to bend it, which also comes with the cost. Now, the inside um, void and the, and the stair, we're going to use the clear one because we want it to look like you have enough in space because when something is clear it give you the notion that it's spacious okay that's what we went for now when i got the coat i was like ah these people are crazy because my specification is it has to have the stainless steel rail stainless steel stud because they have the aluminium one i don't want that the silver whatever they call it and then i also want 12 mm glass tempered glass so <laughs> you can tell the difference all right so my specification is different because the other person used 6mm all right and the design wasn't the same so the quote i had i got from this one the spe specification i gave them was was uh very high so this one they quoted me oh, 95,000 and a little change 95,000 cities and a small chain. I think it's 40 cities on top. But that's what the quote came up to be. Now, I was able to bring it down a little bit and get it where it's reasonable. But at the same time, it wasn't much because the glass alone cost more money. So here is the quote that I got. So as you can see on the screen, um, is 95,000 and some change. Um so it was it was surprising to me okay it was very surprising how you know how much it's going to cost me but that's the specification all right that i gave them so that was the first one they gave me and that is the first one that i really wanted now looking at it they gave me another option which this option has a lot of stainless steel rails but it has less glass in it like minimum glass the stairs will not have any glass it will just have the uh stainless steel rail and then i'll have the void will have the glass and then also the porches will have the same design of a glass but they're going to use they're not going to use the 6 mm but i was going to use 8 mm okay that is it so with this one also the cost came down that is within the range of the you know the referral i got it's like they did the same thing and that's almost within the range of the and they didn't have many porches and many you know the stairs like i do have but that is why i'm saying that 
every building has its own specification everybody has their own taste so here is the the quote for this one it was forty six thousand and some change so that was reasonable you know i was like okay all right but that's not what i want that is not what i want so already i eliminated this one um i wanted a full glass so th then i called them back then they gave me another option which we will talk about um that option the glass has no support when it comes to the um stainless steel rails all right it does it didn't come with it so you will not have that one and that one also came in with a different cost but if i were to just look at the one that the person that gave me the referral what they did i would have said ah these artisans like they're trying to cheat me or something but this is another one they gave me this is the one i was talking about earlier that they gave me that if i go with this the cost will also come down but i have to understand there will be no um guard rails like this like the stainless steel or the studs that will hold it to support it but it will be done it's very strong it will not break it will not do anything but that's not what i want like to me it's just like it looks good but that is not what i want but this one even this one was eighty four thousand and some change eighty four thousand and some change now you look at it and you say hmm, that's quite expensive but remember it's full glass it is full glass it's not like where they cut it and put it in between the stainless steel so i have to understand that one as well the reason why i'm doing this is many a times we get referrals and they go and give us a quote and we think oh this is quite expensive why are they trying to cheat us but this is the quote that i got for this one so you can tell this is also quite expensive all right very expensive the same measurements everything it's just that the prices changes the cost changes now some of this um which i will ask why because if you're going to have 12 mm you have to buy six and six and they have to put it together and that one they will put the film for the tinted in between all right and it's very thick it's tempered glass so here's when they started doing it So here they are doing it like you see it coming on your screen very soon. But here's the quote. I went on site to deal with them and hear the discussion I had with them during the measurement of the um, stairs. And you will hear them talking about it. So then, so that place would just be straight, all right? Yes. And then that one would be only the curve. It will bend, yeah, and then this one will be straight. Yes. And this one will also bend. This one will also bend. The same way as this one. Okay. So it will look like a curve always because the middle. Yeah. The middle is the curve. Yes, actually, this is, if you steady it well, this is where the bend is. Bend is, yeah. Yes. It's the curve. Because it's not the perfect curve like this. Yeah. The curve starts from somewhere and ends there. Okay. Yeah. So. Yeah, because technically that's the curve. Then this one will be straight. Yes. 
Yeah, but it's technically this the only curve that you will see is that one. This one. That's the middle one that's supposed to have the curve. Yes. Yeah, technically that's what I think. That's what I because when you hold this one up. Yeah, it's a straight. This one is a straight line. Yeah. Because if you go more curved, mm -hmm. you no. Yeah. This I think this should yeah. be straight. I think, of the nature. Yeah, I think they are here we now. Uh, curve. Yes. Those two will take care of the curve in the middle. Yeah, yeah. So and then fold it to the end. So it will become something like this. So finally, it will be looking like curvy like this. Mm -hmm. Wow. Okay. Once this one is curvy, it means this is where the curve is. Yeah. You see it? Mm -hmm. So it will look like this. And this will be how the final curve will look like. Oh, it will look like. Okay, let me, let me see. Mm, so you walk. You walk straight and then you curve like that and you go straight. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. It's not bad. If you say you're gonna curve everything, even the step is not a curve. Yeah, it's, it's not a perfect curve. Yeah, this place will be. Yeah, if you say you're gonna curve everything out, it will still give you even a problem when yes. you install. Down. That's the way I see it. Like, yeah. if you install it, if you read the expectation, you say you want to cover everything, you can cover it. Like the price is too much. Even the price is not too much. much. And the curve, the nature of the curve is not it's too much. That's why we have to discuss it. Out. Yeah, yeah. And the, the bad thing is you can see it from only this place and this place. Uh, yeah. Like, even somewhere, even when we do it, uh, if like it's the strong one, the edible one can check. It's peace, peace, yeah, not how to join it. Even this one, where you give it, they can be so bad. On a second look, when a baby looks small, small, and I let's see, so the baby will be a buyer can say, I have to wait to come 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 to so that. So technically, we have finished the step. This is how it's looking like. The only thing that we left is the pipe that we burn at the top. So this one will look like this. Yes. Is it going to be straight enough? Or? Yes, being straight enough. This one will look like this. Okay. Okay, it will look like that. Yes. Okay. And this one will also look like straight like this. Yes. Okay, but you have the curve in the middle. Yes. Because the curve is actually in the middle. It's not, it's not there. Yeah, the curve is supposed to be coming in the middle. Yeah. Not everything curved. Yes, yes, yes. Because everything curved, they are. <laughs> uh, then there is something different. Even the installation will tell you. Yeah, if you curve everything out. The installation will tell you. Because this is where I see the curve. The curve I see Yeah, the curve is in the middle here. See, that's why it's good for all of us to meet on site because otherwise you go and curve everything mm -hmm. and then you come if you install in this challenge. Oh, I said that it will not look nicer like this, like we discussed. Yeah. yeah. Okay, let me stand here and look. Yeah, technically, it's the middle that's supposed to curve. Curve. Uh huh. And now. Uh huh. This side curve. Yeah, just the middle. You don't, and then you join that one to make it look. Otherwise, yeah. I've calculated this, so it will come. It will be very straight. Uh huh. To join, to join it like that. Yeah, and then and the flow will continue. continue. Okay. So as you can see, I had to be on site to All go right. through with them with the stairs because, as I told you. 
The only complaint I had about this building is the stairs. It wasn't sharp enough. So I have to make sure they're doing the right thing. So we have to meet and discuss again. Now remember, they're going to bend both um, the glass for the middle on each side. So the cost then is quite expensive to bend those um, glass as well. But as I told you, sometimes it's good to understand exactly what they're going to do with your spec, your, the specs that you're going to give them, you have to be aware. So what I did, as I said, was I look at all that and said, wow, uh, we have to get a quote for the, for the glass itself, for the bend and everything. So we went to the place that they actually can bend the glass and, and also get the glass uh, uh, manufactured. So I will show you guys when we went just for the stairs, how much they quoted for us for the, for the glass. So as you can see, this is the quote we got <laughs> just for the stairs. You're not talking about the rest of the, of the, of the build, like the porches and everything. It's over 61,000. Um, so imagine if you didn't believe what they were going to do for you. Um, the bend itself costs more money. And doing it full glass, that's how much it's going to cost. But I'm not trying to defend them, but if you didn't know, this is what will have happened. Um, so this, this is the video about either you trust your artisans or um, if you get a referral, your building might be different from other ones, other buildings. So that's what we got. And I have to deal with it. We have to figure out how we're going to be able to pay for everything. But they've got a contract, so they will figure it out um to be able to do it so guys i just wanted to show you uh sometimes um we may have to believe the artisans um and the other times too you may have to make sure that they are not cheating you but that's what i've seen once again thank you for watching i need to hear from you guys whether you think the glass balustrade my choice is better though it's expensive or i should have gone with a traditional or the galvanized steel and then I painted, but as I said, the drawing, based on the drawing of the building, we were going with the glass. So we decided to go with the glass. That's what we chose. But let me know whether you like it and then how the stairs is looking. Um, I will do a video the day that they will be installing the whole thing to see how the building will look. But um, I'm looking forward to it once again. Thank you very much and um, see you next time.